Yo, what up, you smelly intestines? Have you ever woken up in the morning with your heart beating faster than you fucking beat your goddamn dick to the point where your hand just starts shaking when you're holding your mouse and you think you're gonna fucking die? Well, let me just tell you, I made the most stupid decision I've ever made this one morning with that happening to me by drinking a fucking monster. Now, in defense, I did stay up the whole goddamn night and I had school the next morning, which meant that I had to do something to my fucking body in order to keep my eyes awake for the next, like, 18 hours. Okay, maybe not 18 hours, but more like 10 or 12 hours in order for me to walk to school, do all the activities that I'm required to do, get home, syringe some meth into my fucking eyeball, and then hopefully bleed out of my ass. Once I got to school though, I realized the biggest mistake I've ever made, cause here's a little pounding inside my heart that gradually just gets worse and worse, to the point where it feels like there's a medieval fight inside my fucking heart, and I'm getting stabbed to fucking death. Cause now here I am, having to get through the whole entire school day, holding my chest, trying not to fucking collapse, probably looking like I got struck by love, or struck by cancer. Once I got to class though, I had a friend that asked me if I I finished the homework, and let's just call her Barbara Chanel. Barbara Chanel pretty much asked me, did you get your social studies done? And surprisingly enough, I actually did do my homework back then, so I held up my paper, and you can guess, it looked like I was fucking scared out of my goddamn life. So now here I am looking like I believe in cooties, as my friend is also sitting beside me saying, it's just a goddamn girl, get over your fucking fears, it's high school, you need to adapt to talking to girls. So great, now my friend thinks that I'm fucking gay, or that I can't talk to girls, and now my other friend's backing off trying to give me some space thinking that she's goddamn attacked me, when in reality my heart just won't stop beating, and the monster is still digesting which I should have fucking never taken. So the moral of this story is don't fucking take monsters, don't drink monsters, don't syringe them in your fucking pee pee hole, just get rid of them. Just completely avoid them because they're named monster for a goddamn reason. So surprising enough as it is, I actually managed to rank up in this game. As you can see right here, I'm actually rank 7, and I've only had a few days to get to this rank, but I've been grinding a shit ton. As you can see, Nia's level 47. I also have a new ritual that I gotta get done. I gotta escape with an item at least one time. So we're gonna be bringing plunders, and we're gonna be bringing self-care decisive, and we're gonna live forever, because anything that's gonna be helping me get more blood points faster, I'm gonna be wanting to do, obviously. I'm not gonna be bringing any item, because with this ritual, I gotta be finding an item and escaping with that one. I'm also bringing plunders, so why would I bring an item and then bring plunders? Like, come on, common fucking sense. Other than me trying to complete this ritual, this gameplay is just gonna be pretty basic. It's just gonna be a gameplay that I usually experience on a daily basis. I'm just gonna be going in, doing what I regularly do, probably be a complete cunt, and uh, hopefully escape with the item, considering that's what I gotta do. So with that being said, let's try not to fucking die. Wow, that was like the fastest I've ever loaded into a game. And we got the ironworks. Alright, so let's open this chest right here. Hopefully we get a purple flashlight. That's what everyone aims for. Probably gonna get a goddamn brown medkit. But you can never tell what you're gonna get until this very fucking point. <gasps> <laughs> Who's on this goddamn gen? I was gonna give them whatever I get out of the chest and then go open the other two, but fuck that. This is a purple flashlight. Go get the, go get the goddamn ruins. Go, go. Shoo, get the fucking ruins. I guess I'll be getting the goddamn runes. I gotta go get the other chests anyways. I can't be dedicated to gens right now. And what is it? Oh, it's a trapper. Okay. You know what? Fuck that, actually. Let's not get his attention just yet. You happy with yourself? What are you doing? Hi. You wanna go find ruins? This is literally the community, by the way. This is, like, your average fucking player. Can we just get his attention right off the bat? Oh, I wonder if he has, uh, enduring. I don't know, either way, we found the item that we wanted. AKA, a purple flashlight. We don't technically have to open up the other boxes. So we can just, we can just occupy him. And blind him at pallets and be a little piece of shit. He's getting aggressive already. I'm assuming he, uh, trapped the goddamn infinite. Yeah, he just, he did. Got, fuck that. Hopefully no one else steps. I'm running into pallets. Oh, thank God. Okay, he hit her. Pick her up, pussy. Why are you crawling away from the pallet? Alright, well actually, this way he'll actually pick her up without being too scared. Oh, I don't think I can get this. <gasps> Never mind. Never mind. I have I have to give myself faith. I gotta put some faith in myself. And there's the totem. Wait. That's a trap. Okay, thank god I noticed that now. And he knows that I know that's there. He's like, you better fucking die now. 
You know what, my goddamn secrets? Yeah, I also know you got a goddamn trap of the infinite. Why don't you go step in it for me? The fuck? Yeah, lunge at that. Oh my god. What are you doing? <laughs> oh my god! Fuck you! We're not gonna vault that. Because I don't want to get my goddamn shins completely destroyed. I'd rather run this way. What am I doing? Actually, what's my plan here? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm gonna drop, and hopefully... Never mind. Never mind. I'm gonna get stuck on things. That's the ideal plan, boys. And I'm dead. Just kidding. There's a pal here. Fuck you. Hopefully he hears them on the gen. Yeah, okay. We're gonna heal really quickly with self-care too. Someone's gonna vault that window. No, they're not. Because he's coming back for me. What the fuck, Trapper? He probably didn't even lose them. He's just like, I want to get this Nia. She's a piece of shit. Even though I haven't taken your totem away from you yet. Do you guys think he's an average Trapper that traps at the killer shack? I have a feeling he's trapped that window. But I'm gonna vault it anyways, because I don't give a fuck. We're just gonna risk it. And it's been trapped. What a surprise. What the fuck? You having a seizure? God damn, I love it when I'm just jittering on your shoulder. Gives me a spicy feeling. Please tell me he doesn't know where I went. Okay. Alright, we're gonna heal on the fucking hill. Because this game's been going very oddly. I swear to god. I'm oh. <laughs> Look, someone's on your totem. Do you actually care about me this much? Someone's on your fucking totem. Go back for it. I swear to god. I, s I swear to god. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This wasn't a good idea. I don't know- oh, there he is. Did he have time to trap it again? He- what?! This trapper doesn't want to leave me. He just- he, he despises me. I know where his totem is. Don't step in a trap. Don't disarm the trap. You just couldn't go around, could you? You want to heal me? Like, really fast? Come on, let's go. <gasps> we'll make it. Okay, let's get the fuck out of here. You want to go disarm this, uh, this sexy trap at the window? So he can- Oh my god! Don't step in that one! Fuck! Guys! Thank god! Oh my god, what is this game? Where is he? I'm not falling for it! Where are you? You've already deactivated this one! If anything, it's gonna activate itself! There's a trap there, actually! No, there's a trap! There's a trap on the other side of this pallet! That guy got picked up! There's so many traps! This guy is ridiculous! Like, holy shit! He hasn't trapped the window again! What a surprise! I- I made- I made a big mistake. Never mind, he's trapping it. Trap the window, okay? Trap the window. Fuck me. Trap- There's your totem. Can you go to your fucking totem now? I'm dead. Let's get the fuck out of here! Has he still got the infinite trapped? I can guarantee this trap is still here and someone's- Well, if, if it's not, someone stepped in it. Okay, it's still here. Alright, let's heal. How many times have I stepped into a trap this game already? Like, it's fucking ridiculous how many times he's trapped. Like, I'm not even accusing him to be bad or anything. This is like a- This is a really intimidating trapper. So I need to heal fast. I've only got one more hook and I'm dead. And he's proxy camping the person on the hook because there's only one more gen left. And, uh, he probably wants one kill after all these fucking successful traps. He's like, alright, you know what? I've done a pretty good job. I think I deserve a safety pip as well. But I'm gonna still go for the save anyways, even though there's someone already down there. And there's- Yeah, there's a trap right there. I couldn't even see it. Don't run through it! Okay, go now. <laughs> oh, this is a pallet still here. Okay, thank God. Yeah, I got rid of your trap, cunt. Hey, you want to take a hit from me? Like, just, just, just one hit. You still only want me, bro. Break the pallet and give me one more chance, please. That's all I ask. Fuck you. Okay, thank God he's destroying it. I'm gonna go to the infinite now. <laughs> I think there's still a pallet here as well, unless I already used it. I technically already used it, but it's still here. And we have one more there. How many more traps have you- Okay, he's actually putting a trap down. So, hopefully he doesn't have nurses. That's a goddamn Claudette. You know what? Let's go for the other chests. I'm assuming that they haven't opened them yet. There has been a bit of basement action. Oh my god. Isn't that where the totem was? No, that wasn't, was it? The amount of times people have stepped into traps. Okay, they're both injured, right? Yeah, okay, let's get another flashlight save, even though he's trapping again. This is not- this is not fun. This is scary. This is very scary, because the second he sees me, I'm probably gonna die. Even though the infinite is right there. But he's trapped it, hasn't he? There we go. And I'm assuming he wants my dick. No, he doesn't. Okay, let's go- Oh, thank god. Let's go get rid of this trap, just in case we need to use the infinite one more time. Like now? 
Break it! Oh my god! No, <laughs> he knows. He's too good. I'm gonna die this game. Yeah, what are you doing? Okay, he's trapping. Okay, I thought he was trying to back around again. We're not gonna go for the other boxes. We don't, we don't have time. We don't have time, and quite frankly, I don't have the energy to do it, considering I'm probably gonna get my ass eaten to begin with. Like, this game is just so inconsistent. I don't know what's gonna happen. This game, I don't know if I'm gonna die or if I'm actually gonna escape. And you stepped into another trap! Wait, he got out? Or did the trapper pick him up? And you picked him up. Oh my god. Alright, let's open this box. Thank you. Did he pull the plug? Please tell- Oh, never- Oh, what's going on? Oh, come on, don't lag switch. You were such a good killer. He's lag switching, right? Or this is- He's lag switching. He just made him DC. So that's not my connection, that's his connection. And I can't even try opening it. Something's happening. Either way, I did not expect this to be the ending. Trapper, fix your goddamn connection. I'm gonna DC at any- Yep, yeah, there goes another one. Yeah, he's lag switching. He's gotta be lag switching because he's trying to catch up to this guy with his connection being jack shit. He's gonna- And that's the game. God damn it. Why you do this? It only worked out in our favor. We only lost connection and didn't die. Why did you do this? Either way, not only was that a very intimidating trapper that had a million traps that I almost died to, but he fucking lag switched. Or just lost connection in general. Maybe it wasn't his fault. Either way, that was a pretty crazy game. I gotta admit, that wasn't my average game. And I did get a purple flashlight out of it. I- right? Thank- thank- thank the lord. As long as I got my purple flashlight out of it, that's fine. I just gotta add to my collection, even though I'm gonna be prestiging her, like, at any second. Because I gotta get her back to P3, alright? We gotta put the zebra pants on. We gotta put the bloody face back on. We gotta look like a toxic cunt. But for now, this is the set until I get back to my original state. But either way, hopefully you guys enjoyed this round. I wish that I actually escaped her. You know, the ending was a bit different, a bit more casual, a bit more normal than uh, me just losing complete connection. But with that being said, hopefully you guys enjoyed. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good night, guys. Must have been to 11 when the world ended. At least it felt like it at the time. Teenage years make a heartbreak worse. Plus a lot was going on. Couldn't stop it at the time. Dad tried to flip the house. Funny that it all ended upside down. Known for being optimistic, started feeling different. Couldn't fix it, started writing lyrics all because nobody tried to hear.